up, Brick Dudes and Brickettes? Brickman USA back here with another LEGO review. Today's set we are going to be reviewing is LEGO Marvel Studios Black Panther Wakanda Forever, set number 76213, King Neymar's Throne Room with 355 pieces, retailing for $34.99 USD with three minifigs, guys. This is an awesome set, and I really love seeing this movie. I really love the first one, and I'm a fan of the second one. And let's hop into this review, guys. On the side of the box, you see there we have the Marvel logo, nothing too special. And then on the top, we have a picture of Shuri. Nothing that special. Let's take a look at the back of the box. On the back of the box, you see we have a Tuma in Namor attacking Shuri and her sub. And that sub there does look a little gappy on the box. So already I'm not the biggest fan of it. But let's take a look inside the box. Inside the box, guys, here you see we have three bags in the new boring instruction booklet. And we also get a little sticker sheet. Now let's hop into the minifigs. The first fig we get in this set is Shuri. One thing I really love about her is her awesome purple outfit. The purple in her suit really makes it pop. Another thing I really like about her is that awesome hair piece. I don't think I've ever got one of those in my collection before. And here's her second face, just a normal smiling face. Let's hop into the rest of the figs. The next fig we get is a Tuma, and he is a really awesome fig. You see with that blue and kind of that chrome flakes and the printing right there. What I really like though is his dual molded helmet. It's a really awesome piece that Lego went out of their way to look really cool. And his second face is his angry face. I really like his neck printing right there and his legs. It is just a really awesome fig to get in a $35 set. Just awesome job, Lego, on that one. And then last but not least, we get King Namor himself. And this is the reason why I bought this set. Just to get Namor. There you see we get the side foot printing. It is the awesome fig, which is ear printing. It's just awesome to get this fig finally. I always loved him in the comics. But one thing I know people didn't really like is that he doesn't have his earrings or any wristbands or anything. But if you want to add wristbands to him, just get two rings from the Hobbit and add them to there or the Shang-Chi rings, and they look awesome. I've seen people do that. And then here Here's the set without any of the figs and there you could see we have the throne by itself and Shuri sub and honestly that throne right there is just the reason why I bought the set for the throne in Namor. It's just the throne looks awesome and just really captures that underwater-esque that look just makes it really look pop and I'm really not the biggest fan of the sub guys honestly it is just really gappy and it just isn't that great of a sub by Lego I think they kind of just threw it in and said screw it and there on the front you can see we have a shooter a disc shooter on the front of the throne and then on the back you can see we have some hidden gems some awesome features and here are the figs added to the set guys and it really just spices the setup for me it brings a set from a five to a seven five so on the brickman scale it is going to be a 7.5 out of 10 just because for 34 dollars or 35 dollars i feel like it is truly overpriced in my eyes this should have been a 25 dollars set but i know with the marvel with the marvel tax they have to get some money so it just is what it is but honestly just a 7.5 out of 10 on the brickman scale all these figs do come out throughout the whole black panther wave so this isn't the only way to get them but this is probably the the only Black Panther set I'm going to get because honestly this year Marvel hasn't really been that it for me but thank you guys for watching another video if you made it all the way to the end I know I haven't done a review in a while I have a lot more coming soon along with a lot more uh, content coming on the way so thank you guys so much for watching and thank you guys so much for all the recent support Brickman oh